this is a very intelligent question because most of the time when people are talking about the historicity of Jesus they go to the other mythological beings that um, are similar Hiru, Dionysus uh, Serapis, people of that nature but in talking about Jesus the man that became the legend we have to first start with the writings of Josephus Ben Mathia who became Josephus Flavius Josephus Flavius who as a turncoat became part of the Roman government the scribe of Titus lived within the Flavian dynasty his writings concerning the history of Jew, the history of the Jews the antiquity of the Jews he I didn't understand that <laughs> the phone is eavesdropping but that's funny because most people don't understand the writings, the antiquity of the Jews' writings by Josephus. And in, in order to understand them, you have to look at it from this point of view, or you have to understand this. Um, origin. Origin inherited Josephus' writings. Josephus talks about 20 different variations of a man named Jesus in that time frame. He talks about a Jesus who was um, tried but let go. He talks about a Jesus that was flipping tables, a Jesus that wanted to raise arms he talks about the jesus the brother who's the brother of james of dynamis we'll get damnius we'll get to that one but the one that most people jump to is when he talks about jesus in the testimony of flavianus say and then there was this man if he was if you could call him a man and he rose from the dead okay that has been proven to be a a forgery origin talked about the fact that josephus didn't mean to mention jesus what y'all call the christ but then this writing the origins there was the writings were passed on to Pampheus. Pampheus then passed them on to Eusebius. Eusebius in the fourth century is the first one that actually started talking about the that quoted the Flavian testimony of Flavianus. Which is one of the reasons why it's a forgery. Why would Origin complain about him not talking about Jesus, but then the writers were already there? No, they were at him. Also the Jesus the brother of James. It's in there said Jesus the Christ, brother of James. This is a scribes interpolation meaning they added it to get, give it emphasis because Josephus would have never used the term Christ and he never used the term Messiah he used the term charlatan a lot charlatan a whole bunch of times but he never used Christ or Messiah in any of his writings concerning any Jesus's but also if you look at this when you will see that Jesus brother of James whose James is the son of Damnius well according to your scripture Jesus and James daddy name it Joseph not Damnius but from those writings of Josephus you then begin with the man or the men who then come into one to become the legend 